Coming up next, a matchup for the UFC lightweight division title. Our tale of the tape for this, our main event of the evening. Oliveira is one year his senior. He will have a four inch reach advantage. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. It's time! Hiding at a Mecca Russia, presenting the challenger, Islam Malkachev. Fighting out of Sao Paulo, Brazil, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world. All right, this is for the UFC Championship. I want you to bear my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back your corners, come out fight. Well, every time we walk into this here Madison Square Garden, I think I will always think about you in 2017. It was UFC 2. Cody Garbrandt got knocked out by TJ Dillashaw. The Rose Nama Yunus knocked out. The one of the absolutely not crazy. One of the greatest pictures of announcers in sports history. It was all three of us. We look like evil, speak no evil. It was crazy. What a phenomenal. Really making good use of this reach advantage there. With Beautiful body kick. Good series of kick and potentially a critical. And he's back up, but downs have been there. Oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He does. Oh, beautiful takedown by him there as he lands another one. He's keeping the staff guys busy tonight. I mean, over and over, takedown attempt after takedown attempt, and the cardio wrestles that much is so impressive because his opponent is getting back to his feet. But he's got this ability to continue to chase takedowns. Well, not good body language from his opponent here, DC. He's curled up. No, he's exhausted. He's been beaten. Oh, working hard to get back up again, and he's there. Got the single collar tie. Counters now left hook to the head lands. Again, back into this position. And they separate. Take it down. Cut, cut. Over and over, he's securing these takedowns. At that head, or he's going to get blasted. And now he has a headlock trying to pin his opponent's bag down flat onto the mat. Nicely done. A lot of top pressure being applied here. All right, so you gotta be careful. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. All right, feet on the hips here. The horn sounds for the end of round one. Goes in and secures the takedown. Oh man, this ground and pound is good. Probably my favorite striking realm in MMA, and he's as good as it gets. The problem is his opponent is not, and when he does, he creates this space to land a beautiful ground and pound combination. Oh, beautiful straight punch there, DC. He's got an edge in reach, and certainly is making it count in this one. Oh! DC. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Look at how fast. The only big difference. Oh, you gotta watch him attack his submissions. He throws the legs up to try to get a triangle choke here. Oh, he's got one hand in, one hand out. Now you're looking for defensively. Posture's up here and now figures to rain down some ground strokes. Yeah, the grounded position. Man, as he landed a high round two, definitely. Oh! He's in trouble. He Trying to stay in this fight. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Oh, he's got the ground and pound going now. He's putting him in exactly the positions he needs to be in right now. He's able to relax here. A veteran of so many fights that as long as he's on top, he's winning. 
He feels like he's winning here. Oh, lands a stiff punch there. Nice connection. Oh, nice land. Oh, nice. And they separate. All right, so he lands another takedown. He used to get his opponent to the ground. His opponent's done a pretty good job getting back to his. If he constantly goes up and down, up, he jumps on a headlock. We call this in wrestling just a headlock. And if you're not careful, you can get stuck. Oh, and there's the horn at the end of the round. How about this fight, folks? You ready? You ready? Here we go, third round of this championship fight. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job. Oh, that was nice, John. That was nice. Man, the body work really starting to take its toll on that right side. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. And they said, oh, he's hurt. Throw him up. Go get him. Oh, that was a really nice takedown. His opponent here, DC, you got to be careful. Back to the feet. Good right here. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up their shot to the body connects. And that bear's watching. That's going to hurt. Good series of strikes by him there. Great job of mixing it up. Again, going for the tape again. It's because he does such a phenomenal job of timing his entries. Truly, truly inspiring to watch. He got his foot on the hip, and now he's throwing up a triangle attempt. He's going to try to move his left. Posturing up now. And he... All right, great position for him here. He's got the full mount. Let's see if he can get that ground and pound going. Oh, he's got to get it going, but he can't rush. A lot of times, guys get in the full mount, and they rush. Oh! Judo control, a lot of options for him here. Yeah, he can either go ground and pump or he can chase the mission. All right, side control now. Both, both very powerful, very, very explosive. Well, he works hard to get up again here, but he looks hurt. That is how you scramble. How's he going to follow this one? Oh! Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got a pressure. He's got that finish down now. I love her. You don't see that very often. That one landed clean. Nicely done there as he forces the miss from his opponent. Fourth round of a possible Ready? five, and a lot of Ready? fighters change up their training camp when they're fighting five rounds versus two. They're mixing up because fighting for an extra 10 minutes is not normal. Guys, normally it's a 15-minute fight, so you have to do things physically and also mentally to make sure that you... Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Oh! Holy wow. oh, no. He put it to sleep. Bottom fighter trying to control posture, unable to do so. And now he's in a lot of danger. He's got it. Oh, nicely done there. Back to the feet now. Oh. Move out of this position off the bottom. Well, there are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. All right, so he... Oh, and he escapes up to his feet. Very nice. Big kick land. Left hand punch from the clinch. Oh! He needs to start looking... Oh! And it just a perfect shot to end the fight. Landed flush. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming. So a huge, huge win for that young fighter here tonight. Well, another highlight for the real DC as we look back at that scintillating knockout. Yeah, but the whole fight, he was landing great strikes, kicks, punches. He was doing everything right. Until